In this episode of OS First Timer, Dinah will be exploring a graphical interface from 1988 known as Tandy Deskmate 3. Will she be able to complete some basic tasks or will the unfamiliar interface throw her off? Keep watching to find out. So here you are on the desktop of Tandy Deskmate 3.02 from 1988. Tandy Deskmate 1 was released for TRS-DOS and the Tandy TRS-80 in 1984, however it was text-based and not graphical. Over time more versions were released such as Deskmate 2 and Personal Deskmate, which was the first graphical version in 1986. Eventually, in 1988, Desktop 3.0 was released for MS-DOS and IBM computers, and that's the version you're going to be trying out today, which mostly competed with early versions of Windows and Gem, however it required DOS to run, so it was technically an operating system environment, as opposed to a full-blown operating system. But early versions of Windows, including Windows 3, were also technically graphical environments for DOS, as opposed to standalone operating systems. So here you are. TRS-80 Tandy, that brings back a lot of memories. That was my actual first computer, and I recall going into the Tandy store with my father, thinking around 1984, and selecting a Tandy computer. Yeah. But it didn't look like this. It was totally text-based, and I remember typing basic commands yeah. in order to run programs and do things like that. Yeah, so it probably just simply ran TRS-DOS or something like that, yeah. and you didn't have this interface on top I didn't of it. have this, no. So here we are over 30 years too late. <laughs> so. Anyway, can you do your first task that you usually do? What time is it? Yes, 2.08 p.m. Great. Right up there. Now can you write, save, open and delete a text file? This looks like a text thing. Oh, it's highlighted. If the need arises to specify the video driver to be used by Deskmate, use dmvid.exe. Yeah. Well, I've opened a text document. I don't have to write anything. There's already <laughs> text there, so yeah, that's you've fine. you've got to open a new one. So well, how about I this delete one. this and just write, and then that's my new yeah, one. Yeah, but let's see how you'd actually write a new one from scratch. Now, how do you think you open it? Clicking it's not doing... Oh, F4. Oh, I'm so, what that. you can do is, back in the day, if you didn't have a mouse, an alternative was to do F4, F3, and F that, yeah. and F this. But, unfortunately, if you do any F things, you'll basically F the recording, because it'll stop it. The hotkeys. <laughs> so, no, please don't do any Fing. Use okay. the mouse. <laughs> to do stuff. But how do you think you use the mouse? Because you've noticed when you click it, it kind of flicks on and flicks off really fast. How do you think you keep it there? Right click and hold it down. Oh, well, yeah. both of them. Yeah, left, both, or, left right. or right click. You want to get out of this, completely exit. I do, actually. Yeah. Let's... No X. It's a bit weird not mm. having the X, isn't it? Just, oh, I'm going up there and there's only another F thing there. <laughs> um... This operating system is full of Fs. Stop it with the Fs. Exit. Okay. Okay, I'm out of it. Where it says text there, that's basically just a spot where recent text documents are stored. So recent ones that you've written are stored. But if you want to write a new one, you have to go somewhere else on the screen. I've Look. been everywhere else on the screen. I've been everywhere. Calculator, auto config, address, PC. Link, I'll give you a directory. bit of a clue. The camera might be in the create. way. Create. I want to create something. Programs, draw. Draw, filler. Oh, okay. There's more stuff underneath. Yeah. Okay, okay. Hangman, mail merge, PC demo, PC link, telecom, text. Text, yep. That's what we want. Okay, oh. so there you go. Brand new text document. Now, was that hard or was that easy? Oh, uh, I guess I would have. No, it didn't jump out because the camera was covering <laughs> it up. Brand new text document. Okay, so I want to save it now. File. It's hard to get used to Save that, as. It? it is actually. Save as. I'm going to just call it house because it's got a little house at the end of it. <laughs> yeah. Save. Okay. I'm assuming that. Oh, exit. Yeah, there, yeah, there you go. go. Okay, we're out of it. This is just a little bit different to what I'm used to. That's all. Is it better than just DOS and text only? Oh, though? it's better than text <laughs> only. Obviously, anything is. Okay, so there it is there. So yeah. I'm just going to. Congratulations. Go. Done. Fantastic. Now you can get out and delete it. So I'm going to right click it. Doesn't do anything. Wait a sec. Delete. <laughs> Delete name. Yes. Because it's already Great. Right. It's and gone. it's gone. Your next task is to calculate 57 plus 86. Okay. Well, this there's should be the super easy. <laughs> it's right there on the board. So it's 57? Yep. Oh. Oh, well, I'll put it there. That's easier to see. <laughs> 50 oh, plus 86 equals... There we go, 143. There go. Fantastic. That wasn't hard. It's funny, the calculator just so happened to be on the screen. Like, that's a default mm. desktop here. So, so far you've had a lot of luck with all these tasks, but your luck is just about to turn around. Let's 
step it up a notch with something hard. Can you change the colours used in this display I knew you were here? Gonna so view. instead of changing the desktop background, I, I just want you. I'm going to do view. Well, you've got a program open that's kind of in the uh, way. Cancel. So view. What's it? Oh, okay. I'll look at a tree. That just shows you your files on your computer. Okay. So instead of like DOS typing do this, do that, and redefine. If I redefine the desktop, that might change the color. You can give it a go. Oh no, it doesn't look as if it will. <laughs> cancel. I could tell why. Give it a go. <laughs> give it a go. Said. I like that. Give it a go. Yeah. Um. Okay. Well, that's obvious not it. Can we just go back to the normal draw filler? No, it doesn't look like. That's it. That's it. No, it's not there. Well, it must be somewhere else. Oh, well, why didn't you tell me it was somewhere else as I was going through that? Because entire thing? I'm not going to tell okay. you where it is. Well, it's not in sort. It's uh, views kind of like where I'd mm. expect. Yeah. And I know I'm not going to do the normal Windows thing because the right click. Think more to the right side of the screen. Yeah, this is the right side. F9. F10. We'll have a little look at it. What, what happened to F8? I don't know. It's gone. 788. 789. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. right. Okay. No. But I just help. gave you the clue and then you just ignored me P and just said F9, F10. P and where's F8? P no. Wait a sec. Spell checker, calculator, phone list. Empty. Well, that's nice. Let's think. Well, I need help. I'm touching it, but I'm not getting any help. Uh, help is specifically you would have to press F1 to get help. Investigate F10 one more time. But I just did. Yes, but you didn't really. You just read some words and then you didn't actually. But there's nothing. Task switch, alarm, clipboard, corkboard. <laughs> Look at this clipboard and corkboard. Month, phone list, spell checker, calculate, maybe setup. So mouse settings, communication settings, time and date. Oh, colors. Printer, yeah, there we go. Okay, well, that You're was hard. <laughs> that was actually hard. Okay, text background, I'm going to make yellow. On the screen right now, have a look. You're seeing four colors. What are the four colours you see generally on the screen? Blue, blue yellow, matches white, up. and red. So right now, if you wanted to change the blue, this is text background. Oh, so you're changing each of those colours. Yeah, you just change these four colours, oh, the four okay, different okay, colours, okay. and it'll replace the other colours okay, on the screen. So the text background, so I make it... I might make it less blue. You can actually drag the bar if you want, but yeah, that's getting you closer and closer oh, to black. Oh, that looks really awful. I might make it more blue then. But you can add a bit of green in it. If you add green, oh, let's no. say you want to mix them together. See how you can mix colours? No. See, that's green and blue mixed together. That'll do. I don't want to change that. So text foreground. Okay, so you've now. got a bit of red and green mixed together, no blue. So now it's, it's mostly green now. Now it's just a dark red. Now it's a purpley colour because you've got red and blue together. Could it be any harder to read? <laughs> Why you've got blue and blue and blue on the screen? This just makes me feel Actually, blue. What is it? Yeah, all three colours together makes white. Actually, next oh my one. My goodness. Um, no, menu background. So menu background it's is white, white right now. Whenever you customise something, it's always a greeny, bluey, pink, aqua, hellish, radioactive, sickening. Insert more words here. Colour. Yeah, that's a real. <laughs> okay, so menu bar. So that's that red colour. Oh, no, I don't want it pink. I'll just have it purple. That'll do. Oh, I feel sick. Okay, now that's it. I've done. Mm -hmm. Brightness. Can I make it brighter? No, there's nothing more for you. And we're going to make it temp uh, permanent. Okay, okay. Oh, my gosh, I feel sick. I actually feel like I'm going to throw up. Can I just say, I don't know if this induces vomit feelings to anybody, but I'm like, I'm not, I mean, not even to be offensive <laughs> right now, I'm actually feeling sick. I actually can't take this. But there we go. That is how Diana customised the desktop. Mm -hmm. That is her um her customisation for it. I'm just going to customise it myself because I just can't. No, 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 leave it. I leave need it. to. Oh, I'm going to get sick. The viewers are going to go blind and we can't even see what the heck is going on in the video for the next things you're going to be doing. Oh. I'm going to go for, a, uh, you know, an old fashioned green on black. Let's make it easy to see. That's not easy to see. Yes, it is very easy to see in comparison oh, to what you Oh, but that's made it go back in time. There's less colours now. That, that's more <laughs> More primitive. Yeah, well, I'd rather... <laughs> Sometimes you have to take a step back to take a step forward, as they say. You know, and newer isn't always better. Insert more quotes here. Anyway, moving on. I want you to now explore the operating system yourself. What did you say, insert more quotes here? 
insert more quotes here because I've run out of your is better quotes. So what are you going to do when you edit it? You'll insert a whole stack more quotes? No, I'm just telling oh. the viewers, like, imagine EC... It's almost oh, okay. instead of saying ECT, like, etc., etc., I'm saying it. Insert more quotes here. Like, you okay. know, imagine the viewers, whatever other quotes... You know, we'll probably have comments now of other people. You know, newer isn't always better. The good old style. I don't know. Yeah, simple whatever things quotes. in life are often the best. Yeah, that kind of thing. Okay, next. That was a task. Explore the operating system yourself. So was there any programs in there like draw? If you want to investigate the draw program, maybe you want to investigate, you know, that kind of thing. How about you have a little look? Let's take a look at draw. Now to draw, where's the, is that a line that I can... Click it one more time because you didn't click it properly. Now see how it's pushed in. It's almost like a 3D button. Oh! Oh, there we go. Nothing. Oh, there you go. So there's no preview. You click, you draw, and you drag, and then when you let go, that's when you actually see the square. Mm -hmm. See? So there we go. So it's kind of, you don't know what you got till it's here, if you know what I mean. Okay, A, B, C. Easy as one, two, three. S, F, M, H, A. Wow, that is slow, isn't it? Does it yeah. feel like this slowness of these ancient days just drives you nuts? There we go. So that is the drawing program. Oh, that one joins wherever you... Oh, wow. That, I like that one. Let's check out another program now. So we'll get out of it. Exit. No, we don't need to change this. So we've got um, filler. What is filler? I, I don't know. So maybe just... it's just a bit of a filler. <laughs> filler in the menu. Filler for something, yeah. Ah, uh, so open no. filing. Let's not. Oh, wait. Inventory to fill. Double click that. Oh, I see. Look at that. That's kind of cool. <laughs> this looks like you're hacking some ancient computer right now. I feel like you're hacking into some government database and um, changing the stereo receiver or something. Mm. In fact, it's probably a database type thing. Look. Oh, yeah. Look at that. TV. TV. $399.95. Yeah, that's cool. Everything's $99.95. Oh. Yeah, Radio oh. Shack TC, 19-inch color TV, high contrast screen. Yeah, it must be some kind of, you know, you can add records here and mm. you can write your own ones, you see. So that must be what that is. It's almost like a little database or record type thing. Form set. I wanted to see what form set is first. Would you like to create a new file? Oh, these are just setting up messages. No. Hang oh, man. Oh, you oh, clicked kill. No. Oh, well, since <laughs> yeah, you yeah. wanted to see yep. it. Uh, what's it going to be called? New. There we go. cock a do <laughs> I think you're going to write something. Okay. Do. No. <laughs> cock a doodle do. No, didn't you hear him outside? Okay, let's move on. So, file. There he is. He's cock a doodle doing. So, I'll exit that. Yep. How about yeah. we give Hangman a go? Well, I'm trying to get there. Hangman. File not found. Oh, oh, look at all that. It's not even there. Do you want to try worksheet? Let's see. Worksheet. Oh, there you go. This is like um, uh, Excel. Excel yeah. spreadsheet. So let's say you have $12. They already put 43. it in. Yeah, they assume it must be. But how would you say it equals plus A2? Invalid. <laughs> well, how do you do it then? Wait, it's not A. Look. What? It's one, 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 two. I, I just realised it's not A, B, C, D, like a typical yeah. thing. Yeah, row three, column one. Okay, so that's... Let's hope this works. <laughs> oh, no, sum! What? Sum. There's a sum. Oh, maybe you so... have to type sum. Sum? <laughs> you have to type sum. <laughs> yeah, I think oh, you'd need brackets so around it. this is so frustrating. This is the worst. <laughs> Spreadsheet. I don't like this spreadsheet. How this is using help. Deskmate. It's not a very good mate, is it? <laughs> what is Deskmate? And what, was it created in Australia? Mate? Yeah, mate. Oh, it doesn't specifically have that program, it looks like. A keyboard tutorial to what? <laughs> teach you what keys are on your yeah, keyboard? Yeah, mouse tutorial. No, probably keyboard tutorial is what does what in it. How to use a mouse. Did you have a mouse for your computer? Your Tandy? No, I had a mouse okay. in a cage outside. <laughs> when you click this, you can actually see that sum thing there. Something there. <laughs> something there. But... I meant that something you get. Yeah, uh, it's there, but it's not doing anything. It's not I summing. That. <laughs> oh, calculate. I figured it out. Where? I did it. <laughs> so you, after all that, you go to pad and you click calculate. Oh, no. And it, so it doesn't order. So we're here <laughs> so wondering you how you do it. So you put the formula in and it doesn't, and it doesn't calculate it. So every time you want to calculate it, let's say I change and this. So you literally going into a different So let's say you change thing. that to 356. Yeah. See how it doesn't change? Yeah, yeah. So you literally got to go to pad, calculate, and it oh. updates them. 
So we knew what to do. We just it just doesn't auto calculate. Oh, that is so funny. That's well, a very time consuming. I think you'd be better with you calculator, pen, and paper, and then just do Control C. There. Mm -hmm. Okay. Look at this loan. There you go. There you can see an actual spreadsheet in action. Mm -hmm. So there we go. What did you think of Tandy Desk Mate 3.02? Well, I didn't like the spreadsheet for a start. <laughs> well, it's not bad. You just had to do basically it wasn't it friendly calculate. so i don't know why they called it mate <laughs> yeah but in comparison to dos is it okay. friendly in comparison to dos it is preferable but at the same time there's better operating systems out there i feel yeah although as i said before this isn't an operating system this is an operating environment that runs on top of mm. dos like windows 1 2 and 3 were operating environments just so you know what happened to the future of this program there were a few more minor versions after this that were released however when windows 3 3.0 was released in 1990, it kind of died because people thought, oh, am I going to use Windows 3 or am I going to use this mm. on, you know, instead of DOS? And most people chose Windows 3. Later, they even rewrote DeathMate and released it as WinMate for Windows 3.1, but that actually died too. It was very colourful. You probably would have liked the WinMate, but yeah, that died too. Okay, so there we go. That was Tandy DeathMate 3.02. We will see you next time in the next episode of OS First Timer. Bye. Bye.